Hello everyone, I'm going to do a quick overview of my current build. I'm playing as a Zork and using the skill Ice Shards. And I'm going to show, start showing off the gear. Our helmet, we pretty much have cooldown reduction as the most important stat. We also have some lucky hit chance. Chest piece, a defense item overall. We have the gloves. Uh, we have additional ranks to Ice Shards and some other offensive stats. Legs, also used as a defense item overall. We have the boots, we have movement speed, mana cost reduction, additional ranks to teleport and frost nova to lower the cooldowns. We have an amulet, also again additional ranks to defense skills to lower the cooldowns. We also have a flat cooldown reduction. We use the imprint to give our core and master skills additional critical strike chance when we cost them above 100 mana. We have our rings with vulnerability, critical strike chance, luck hit and critical strike damage. The other ring is pretty much the same stats as well. Then we have our weapon. We use a wand with lucky hit chance. We have an ability damage, intellect, core skill damage, with strike damage. We also have the imprint for the avalanche keystone here as well. Then we have an offhand with cooldown reduction, resource generation, cooldown reduction, barrier generations, critical strike chance. Overall, excellent gear. Pretty much, I don't have so many dead stats. I can talk a bit quick about how the interaction works. Uh, we are trying to utilize the keystone as much as possible. We stack lucky hit chance in order to make this proc as much as possible. When it procs, it gives us additional damage and, it, and the costs are for free. And we can use this even more thanks to our some mana stacking as well. Uh, we try to keep our mana above 100 as long, much as possible to get the critical strike bonus. Our current mana is 131 and our costs are 27 mana, so we can do two costs with eye shards. We still use having pretty much 100% critical strike chance, and this is gives us a lot of damage versus bosses. And we are bosses are pretty much almost vulnerable thanks to our very low cooldown on our frost nova. That's pretty much how the build works. Comment, like, and subscribe if you like to see more. Thanks. Bye bye.